Is time travel real? Well, I can tell you it is from the multidimensional perspective. I've experienced it, and I'm going to tell you how I was able to transport back in time and be standing with a younger version of myself. This is going to be mind-blowing. Stay tuned. So it was just the morning uh, a couple weeks ago. I was laying in bed and just sitting there relaxed. Uh, it was a beautiful day outside and birds were chirping. And all of a sudden, as I am doing my breathing so that I could get really present and then start the day, I start focusing in on the birds, something very familiar with the birds chirping. And the next thing I know, I am being pulled down a black tunnel, almost like a wormhole type of feeling, and I am viewing my younger self. And this was incredible because I still had the presence of mind and the awareness that I was laying in bed, but at the same time, I was viewing a version of my younger self. And what was so fascinating about this moment is that I was, my younger self was in a classroom and I recognized where it was. It was my grade school, probably had to be, oh, I don't know, second, uh, probably third, third or fourth or fifth grade, probably third grade. That's about the age I looked. And I was sitting in one of those desks in the classroom and I was just there looking at myself. And I felt as though I could actually communicate with myself. It was the most amazing feeling. And it's as though I was there and I know I was there. And what happened was the, the sound of the bird, the singing of the bird triggered this whole event. And it put me into this frequency, this alignment with this point in time that was in my past. And it was a beautiful spring day. You know, it's fall here now, but the, the event that I, that I was pulled to was a spring day, bird chirping, beautiful day outside, sitting there looking at my young self attending school. And that was an amazing event. And it lasted not long. It was probably maybe 30, 40 seconds. And then I was pulled back into my body. And again, the whole time I had the awareness of being here in, in laying in bed and being there. And like I said, I, I felt like I could have communicated with myself and I probably could have. Um, but what's incredible about, about the situation is what I, I term it as a bilocation event where I was able to be in two places at once across two different timelines. So whatever happened with the birds aligned me with the frequency of this situation and I was able to travel there. Most incredible thing ever. And this is what happens when we move up the dimensional scale, up in frequency, up in vibration, towards 5D and 6D and beyond as we start to have these glimpses. And a lot of people might just um, chalk these up, those that have these types of experiences, as as just memory or imagination. Um, this was a very acute sensation of being pulled, instantly transported my consciousness to this period in my past to experience this and witness myself sitting there. And the beautiful thing about this was I was in communication with my guide after this event and he had explained to me exactly what had happened and that it was a real by location event. Now, they were, they're kind of random. I've had others like this. I've been on, on ships. Um, and, and of course, this event where the sound of the bird aligned me. But he told me that as I continue to grow, I'm going to start to be able to take conscious control over these types of events and be able to move um, through the higher dimensions into different points in time. And of course, meet with versions of my higher self uh, and other incarnations and that kind of thing. So this is multidimensionalness at its core. And I've been experiencing glimpses like this for a little while now. And um, every time they become more familiar 
and they become more detailed and more incredible. So I just wanted to pass this along. I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, keep doing your work. I wanted to bring this to your attention so that it is in your awareness. If you ever feel shifting or you feel energy and flow, things like this when you're present, follow it. Follow it and let it take you. And be aware with no resistance and just accept what comes. And more of these types of situations will open up for you. Thank you. Thanks for stopping by. I hope you really enjoyed this video. Go ahead and click the subscribe button if you found that this content resonated with you. I'm going to be putting stuff up frequently um, around these, these types of subje subjects of spirituality, enlightenment, and so forth. Uh, also, jump on over to Instagram at CosmicLightBody11. Go ahead and follow uh, for some really cool short videos and things of that nature uh, that are put up uh, throughout the week. Thanks again.